The existence of extraterrestrial beings has always been one of the greatest mysteries in human history, with numerous rumors, videos, and stories circulating that remain unproven. Recently, a video circulated on social media, capturing a large number of police vehicles converging in the city of Miami, the capital of the southeastern state of Florida in the United States. In the video, a blurry object appeared, suspected to be an extraterrestrial creature with an unclear shape. The authenticity of this story raises questions. Let's delve into the details in this video. On January 6, 2024, an account named Good Lion TV uploaded a short clip from an aerial perspective overlooking the streets of Miami at night, supposedly recorded on New Year's Eve. In the video, the uploader claimed that a strange dark figure was moving near police cars, asserting it was an extraterrestrial force. An extraterrestrial over three meters tall was shot both from inside and outside the Miami Mall. Currently, the media remains silent because the police want to cover it up, quoted from the accompanying article. Within a day of posting, the clip garnered 7.5 million views, and the sharing rate was rapidly increasing. As around 50 teenagers caused disturbances outside the state's support area by setting off fireworks to celebrate the new year, the Miami police mobilized a large force of patrol cars to the area. It was during this time that the peculiar scene was captured in the video. However, Rafael Horta, a police officer in Miami, dismissed the rumors on January 1st, stating that the three-meter-tall extraterrestrial was, in fact, a pedestrian, and the shadow scene was theirs. He emphasized that there was no extraterrestrial being at the time. Miami police arrested four teenagers, explaining that the extensive deployment of armed forces was due to citizens mistaking fireworks for gunfire, leading to reports to law enforcement agencies. The police clarified that they responded to the central Miami mall because a brawl had occurred, resulting in the arrest of four teenagers with over 60 police cars rushing to Bayside Marketplace in the downtown area. The suspects had disrupted public order by launching fireworks at each other amidst the outdoor shopping center. Despite the official explanation, doubts persisted on social media, with some suggesting a conspiracy involving extraterrestrial involvement. Michael Vega, a Miami police officer in charge of communications, reaffirmed that the incident had nothing to do with extraterrestrials. He stated, that there were no extraterrestrials, no airport closures, and that they were not hiding any information from the public. However, the account Good Lion TV on social media expressed skepticism about the police statements, questioning why mainstream media did not provide any factual information despite the significant police presence. Furthermore, another account on social media asserted that the city and state authorities were concealing information by providing a convenient explanation. With suspicions that the massive police mobilization might be more than just quelling a few gunshots. A social media user claimed to have zoomed in on the video, identifying a grey creature walking among the police cars, suggesting that the Miami extraterrestrial incident might remain unsolved, similar to recent cases in July 2023. David Crute, an intelligence officer from the U.S. Air Force had previously declared contact with extraterrestrial beings, but had his information suppressed by the government. In response, U.S. defense officials rejected Crute's claims, stating that there was no evidence supporting the U.S. hiding UFOs. NASA also emphasized its commitment to searching for extraterrestrial life, but stated that there was no credible evidence so far. In September of the same year, Mexican journalist Jaime Maussan presented what he claimed to be authentic evidence of extraterrestrial beings to the Mexican Congress. He displayed two specimens resembling small humanoid bodies with abnormal skull sizes, allegedly found in a sand mine in Peru in 2017. 
The Mexican National Autonomous University dated one specimen to be 700 years old. The credibility of Mossan's evidence faced skepticism. In conclusion, the recurring theme of extraterrestrial encounters, often centered in the US, has fueled conspiracy theories about secret government organizations such as Majestic 12. These theories involve the government hiding evidence and manipulating public attention through UFO stories. The mysterious Area 51 in Nevada has been at the forefront of such rumors with allegations of UFO research and extraterrestrial meetings. While rumors and conspiracy theories persist, the US government has never officially acknowledged extraterrestrial encounters or UFO-related issues. The secrecy surrounding Area 51, with strict security measures and constant surveillance, adds to the mystique. The Majestic 12 organization, allegedly established by President Harry Truman, was created to erase any traces of UFOs on US soil and worldwide. Ultimately, it serves as a tool to keep the public in perpetual mystery, lacking concrete evidence, but fueling ongoing speculation. What are your thoughts on the extraterrestrial issue? Feel free to comment and let us know. Don't forget to like and subscribe to support our YouTube channel. Thank you very much.